Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Southern with Charm. So today's video, I'm going to be organizing my junk drawer. I was looking for some batteries the other day and had a hard time finding them because the drawer is so packed and there's just a lot of stuff in there. So I'm going to take everything out and get it nice and organized and show you how I do that. Hopefully it can give you either some motivation to get yours organized or give you some ideas on some ways to get yours organized. Um, thank you so much for stopping by and for watching this video. I really hope that you like it. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and leave your comments down below and I would also love for you to subscribe. Thank you so much.
junk drawer organized and I will show you what the inside of that looks like in just a second. But now I have a ton of candles there on the floor and a huge mess on my table of things to clean up. I found some tools for my elliptical workout machine which is upstairs so I'm going to put these upstairs with the machine because I didn't even know that I had these in the junk drawer. I also found some parts that go to one of my light fixtures. I think it's the one in my dining room. I think it's spare parts so I need to put that somewhere else. I found all of these cords, which I think they're all either cable or internet cords, and I have a big container out of my garage that has all of my extra cords that that bag needs to go in. I can't believe that I found this camera. I have no idea what's on it. I I kind of think that it was from my daughter's, okay, well, yeah, that answers the question because there's her name on it. Um, it was from preschool, I think, so I'll need to get this developed and see what's on there. Um, I found this light cover and the paint color that matches my the bottom part of my kitchen wall, as you can see right there. And all of these are paint sample colors because I'm getting ready to paint some of the areas upstairs and I wanted to do a gray so I'm going to put all these with all my other paint supplies for now. I found a ton of user manuals for miscellaneous electronics and my grill so I need to put these with the rest of the user manuals that are upstairs in my office. I also found two bags of note cards, blank flashcards with Sharpies that I was using to make flashcards for my daughter for learning multiplication and all of that stuff needs to go with the school supplies along with one of her pencil sharpeners. So I've got a little bit of a mess to clean up but my junk drawer is organized. Let me show you what it looks like. So I put, I'm sorry, the lighting's not the best. I put all of my tools right here in this basket. And then this basket has um, flashlights and some tape and hand sanitizer. And then my daughter's bug bands are right there and some extra packages of Kleenex. Sorry, let me close the door. I didn't realize my garage door was still open partially. Okay, and over here I put um, some of my recipe books. I don't think it's very functional for them to be in the drawer like that because you can't really see them, but um, as you can see up under here there are two cabinets and it is slap full of other things that need to be organized including more recipe books. So when I tackle that part of this cabinet I will put all of those recipe books with it. Um, I have a ton of empty air freshener plug-in things. I don't really know why you need that many, but I have that many, so um, they're all in that basket right there. I have these two packages of unopened batteries that I put in this basket, and then underneath is some blank pads of paper that I can use for jotting down notes or whatnot. Here is batteries. Um, these little containers were on sale at Walmart. I feel like they were 50 cents. They're actually crayon holders and I grabbed probably eight or ten of them because they were so cheap because I knew that I could use them for things like this for batteries. So those are my double A's and my triple A's are right there. And then I had two decks of cards which I probably should put those with all of the other games, but they're going to stay in the drawer for right now. And I had four different rolls of box tape. And apparently, any time that I needed a roll, I didn't realize I already had one in this drawer. I wouldn't have kept buying them. So I have plenty of tape. Not sure what I'm going to use it for, but there it is. 
And then I had some extra power strips, which I feel like they need to be out in the garage somewhere with some other electrical stuff, but for right now they're just going to stay in that box until I can get out in the garage and find a place for them. So it looks so much better and it's functional and I can get to things now as I need them. Now I've just got to clean up the rest of my mess and find a home for all of these other things that are sitting over here.